Okay, I sorry, I was looking in the wrong corner to see if it was recording or not. Um Okay, so I did a few things without you. Um I just added birchwood planks for the walls all the way around this room, the game room. Um so I did tell you this is supposed to be a variety house and if you look at it from the top it's only made out of five different materials, maybe six if you include like the iron on the garage and the glass stuff. I don't know, but it's diverse, I guess, and that's how I wanted it. Um, okay, so yeah, I just added birchwood walls, and then I'm the roof is also gonna be birchwood planks. Okay, so for this deck right here, porch, balcony, or it's not a balcony because it's not off the ground. Okay, so we want to, I'm just going to give you the design for it, and then you're going to take it all the way around the house. So that is the size of the house. Of course, if your yard is bigger, or if you want it to be a little bit bigger since it is a mansion, then feel free to do that, of course. Um, but that's all I'm going to be doing. And I don't even know if it's best to watch my videos because I'm a beginner. This is only the fourth house I've ever built. And one of those was a tree house. Well, that's a lie, actually. I built a few on Pocket Edition, but that's way different because you only have, like, 20 materials. All right, so you want to come all the way over to here. And then come all the way over to the spot where the house becomes uneven. Oh, frick, I'm spazzing. So right there. And then we're going to add a door in the bedroom. So then you want to fill that all in, make it four, make it come out four, and then put the glass planks, glass pane, sorry, on the, on the fourth block, just like we did over here. And then fill it in with birchwood planks. And then fill the ceiling in. If you really want to, you can put a doorway right here. But I think it looks best open, like that. Okay, so what is next? Okay, I'm just going to add like a little sunroof. Just to give it some light in here. Alright, that's better. Just those planks are so dark. Um. Okay, so we have the mud room. Entrance room from the garage, that's what we're going to call it. Alright, so in the garage you can build a car. There's tutorials on YouTube on how to do that. And in here, let's make a little bench. So, let's just use stone bricks, stairs. So there's your little bench. And then we want to make little cubbies. Um... What do we need to make cubbies? Alright, so grab stone slabs. And then just... Make little cubbies. Alright, one little cubby. Two little cubbies. Dang, it's three wide. Ain't it? Alright, there's one. Okay, there's another one. Okay, so now we have little cubbies. Let's go sleep really quickly. I'm just going to turn off this light so that there's not so much glare. Because I think there's a lot of glare right now. And then I'm going to turn my brightness all the way up. That might actually create more glare. Hope not. I love that pink color of the sky over there right now. It's so smexy. So this is going to be the best house I've ever built. I hope... So far, the best house I've ever built is that modern house right over there. That will be up on my second channel. 
probably a few parts by the time you see this. It's only like September 20th right now. Um, but by the time you see this video, some of the parts will be up on my second channel. And, okay, so that's it for this room. Um, you could also make like a little, like a big shelf that goes all the way up. Just like that, and then like that. I don't know, and then you could even come across like that if you wanted to, or just leave it open. Okay, I or we could even make like a little closet. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make a little closet. Well, I'm out of spruce wood planks from right here all the way to like right here. So the frame of the first floor is done. I'm going to decorate the first floor, furnish the first floor, whatever you want to call it, before I start on the second floor. Um and just because I don't want to have to furnish it all at once because I, to be honest, I don't really love decorating it as much, but it's not bad. Okay, I still don't know what I'm going to do with this room in here. Well, besides the bed, obviously we're, no, just kidding, we're not done. Okay, so in this big closet. We're going to add another torch. What do I have that's like a hook? A hook. Um. Darn. Hopper. What does this sexy son of a thing do? Um, there's actually some pretty cool stuff in this redstone section. Here, I want to see what this. Hopefully, it's not going to, like, destroy my house. That is actually pretty freaking awesome. That's what I'm using for my sink. Okay, we're just going to put two of those up there. I don't know why. Alright, in here... That just leads into the other room, doesn't it? No, please. Dang, that sucks. I'll fix that later. Alright, this hopper thing. This thing is pretty freaking amazing. Alright, so for the sink, let's just... Do two hoppers side by side, then get a lever, a lever, L E V E R, a lever, and then just place it above it so it looks like a faucet. Can you even see what the heck I'm doing? Or is it too freaking dark? Please be able to see. All right, so there's the finished product. I just got two hoppers and placed levers above it. I'm going to try to pull the lever now. I'm sorry that you can't see crap. I'm going to be trying to get a better screen recorder eventually. Um, or just downgrade. Okay, what do I need? Bucket. When I'm outside, it's not bad. But inside, when it's... Oh. Item hopper. So that's what it is, is it? So if I put a door in it, then it just holds my door. Alright, we don't need water in it. Okay, then over here, we're just going to do my traditional fancy little... Um, original toilet. Hopefully you can't see that number. Because it's not one of my best friends. If it was, then you could 